Um, pound it. After the last couple of days. You can't pound it and then keep talking. That's not how it, it works. <laughs> Welcome to day 20 of Advent. We're almost there. Final push. Final push. Indeedly do. Um, there you go. Oh, sorry. Oh, what could that be? Fumpteen. Fifteen? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. This is, a, this is one that may or may not appeal to you. We'll see. Um, it will certainly appeal to some, some men who are watching. Uh, this was nine pounds. It's 24 days of beard treats. Oh, I've got a beard. You have got a beard. Um, it's Bearded Man Company's beard oil calendar, basically. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to put beard oil on my face now. Well, that's what you could smell them. We'll smell mm. them. You know, it's not saying put all of it on there either. It's saying massage a few drops into your beard once or twice a day. I think this was probably a mankind purchase, but I will investigate and put the price on the screen of what it should be and where I got it. Now, should I just go for it? Go for it and see what's... No. <gasps> I mean, yes. Tiny, tiny, little bottle of bay rum, I think that is. Ugh. It's really small and it's going to be oily. It is. Come on. But, uh, um, I can actually... Let me just... Did it open it? I can't smell... Oh no, oak moss I can kind of smell. I don't really know what oak moss is. Like, I know what oak is it's... and I know what moss is. Is it moss that grows on an oak? What just is Just words, it? Hannah. Uh, number four is mahogany. I guess. Yeah, mahogany. I mean, I would hold each one of these up, but they're just... They're so tiny. Little tiny bottles. Uh, what? I don't know what a nag champer is. A nag can be an annoying woman or it can be an old horse, can't yes. it? Yes, it can. Careful. I can see it in your eyes. Uh, I, but I don't know what champa is. I've no idea. This is all like foresty wood smells, isn't it? So I don't know. I'll look it up. Uh, nag champa is... Make the words. It's a fragrance of Indian origin. It's made from a combination of sandalwood, which I think is what we could smell. Sandalwood's in incense, yeah. And uh, something like frangipani or champak, whatever that is. Frangipani. So two, uh, two, yeah, incensey kind of smell for that okay, one. Put that in a different pile. So we've got that's wood. That's, that's and forest. wood and quite fresh pile. That's put that in the next incense. pile. Shall I gut this and make it easier? Because I can no, just take just, the top let's off. Let's just keep going. But it takes forever to fish these out of the tiny little foam holes. You bought a calendar every day. You have to suffer. This is just like fresh. I do. fresh. What's that mean? This was day twenty-four. Steel. Oh, steel. Steel. Mm hmm. That's going in the intermediate pile. What's it smell of? Just smells of like Steel. great fragrance. I've noticed that they've spelt essential oils wrong on the back. Well done, lads. It's not hard when you make beard oils to get the get that right, but um, it would be nice to have just a little bit of blurb going what the heck everything is. This is a uh, vetiva, which is uh, a big clumpy green grass from India. Same family as lemongrass. Oh, drop the t drop the lid again. And citronella. That's. Stronger, but it's quite nice. Okay. You should smell that one. I think you might like it. Smell. Little smell. Oh yeah. There is a nice little. I can kind of smell the citronella. I can see. Yeah. I can tell it comes from a similar thing. Is it going in the? This is getting very long. This beard oil category. It's sandalwood. Just make it uh, How am I getting a couple of drops out of each one? I guess you just. I guess you do what you do with a little perfume vial and you turn it upside Lavender. down. Oh, that's quite flowery. Then we have spice. Which, I'll be honest, kind of smells a little bit like sandalwood again, or that kind of thing. I, it's I don't know what spice it is, but it it's not really festive spice. It's just there's just spice. Spice. And this one, which has almost no smell, and I expect it to have some based on the orange Sicilian lemon. Ooh. And I've gutted the calendar. It's nice. 
Okay, so this one. Which was what? I don't know. Uh, nag. Nag Champa. Nag Champa is too smelly to go on my face. It's too, yeah. I don't want to be smelling it's too the smell. too Yeah, I don't want to be smelling the smell of what's on my face all day long. I know yeah. that that's the point, but I would want it to be a bit more subtle because I don't really like highly fragranced things. Yeah, you either like incense or you don't. It's a very specific um, it smells level like of smell, isn't it? It's student veg me. So that's a no. That's a no. These ones here in the central aisle, they are not my favourites. And what they all have in common is they're like a medium smell mm. on the smell a meter Well, they're like lavender, which is a bit of a... It's a very flowery yeah. smell, and I don't really like flowery smells. Yeah. Sets my sinus off a bit. Yeah. And then we've got all of this big, massive, long pile, mm. which is things that have a very subtle smell. Yeah. And I might put I might put one on. Cool. So if you want to pick what you'd like my face to smell of out of those options. Should we go with Spanish orange? Okay. Which one? Not that one. No, it's Woo! this one. Orange. They can't see them on the it's tape. It's like... But... It's quite druggy. All these little what, blast yeah, bottles. Yeah, look. <sighs> Welcome to my dispensary. So what am I doing? I'm doing Spanish orange. Yes. So it's it's a few drops, yes? Yes, one or two. On your beard, rub it in. Oh, it does smell orangey. Does it? I, wow. I smell like... I'm gonna try a bit more, because oh. I didn't quite get any in the under beard, like this oh. area. Oh. Going in for a double dip, grief. Oh, I smell like a Terry's chocolate orange. <laughs> do you actually? Do mm. I just come around and sniff you? Oh, yeah. Orange. Tucker's luck. Weird. Nice, but weird. You've used up, just so people can see how much. You've used up a little bit, so I'd say you probably get I don't even know if the camera can see that. No, it can. Yeah? I'd say you maybe get six applications out of it. I feel like that's about right. Enough, I guess, to judge whether you want to buy more from them as well. Um, I do wish, out of five, nine quid is not bad, I think. Again, I need to investigate whether this is on sale or not. Uh, I've got no idea what beard oil costs. I think it's one of those things that you can spend yeah. however much you like it's on. It's like Moroccan, yeah, like Moroccan hair oil and argan oil and all that stuff. Same it's thing. like you could spend so much money or 99 pence. Um, I like them. I think they. I think the information would be helpful on here. You know, just for stuff like Nag Trampa, just so you can go, oh, that's what that is, or the the um, spicy beard. I don't even know where it's gone, but the, the Indian grass that I had to Google. Just a little bit of extra blurb. Um, also things like the stickers aren't all level on the bottles. Just little bits of attention to detail. It's not the end of the world. Um, but it doesn't feel as polished as it could be. That's all I'm saying. So out of five, you give it... I think I would also, obviously I don't have a beard, so part of this I can't judge it for. I want to say three? Because also, also I've thrown it on the floor, but this is not recyclable. Oh dear. I can recycle these, turn them into seed things. How? Put the seeds in them, job done. Or no. I can, we can at least recycle the glass part of these, right? We can't recycle the black plastic top, lads. That's not done in the UK. Um, three, I think. I think three's fair. It's beard oil. What do you want me to say about it? Well, you're sorted for probably a year because you're. I'm never sorted for the rest of my life. <laughs> when have you ever known me put anything like that on my face? I, apart, apart from maybe once, probably attended a wedding. That's no, it's about it. Fancy, fancy, yeah. And also, I knew I'd probably be getting a bit smelly. It'd be lovely when I go out. Yeah, you'll be able to go, hello world, look at me and my beautiful Sicilian Hello world, I've missed lemon. you. Smell my beard. Yeah. <laughs> also, the cat won't like them, but that's fine. She'll think it's strange and weird. 
strange smell of things. Um, all right, three out of five, nine quid. All right. Nine quid, three out of five. Not bad, bearded man company. I would say though, essential oils doesn't need an apostrophe S. Thanks. You should know that by now, oil company. We'll see you tomorrow for day 21. <laughs> God knows what it's going to be. Hopefully it's no more electrics. Ah, too slow.